Hello singers, my name is Mirosław Grabski. I'm a professional singer and a vocal coach. I help choral and solo singers to improve their singing technique. Today we will dive into one of the most beautiful ornamentations in music, which is called the trill. We will use lesson number 11 from Nicola Vakai, Metodo Pratico School of Singing, Se Povero to improve your singing technique, to know how to use it in our vocal productions. So without further ado, let's get started. So a trill is a rapid change between two adjacent notes, usually a tone or a semitone away from each other. It's like a quick fluttering pitch, adding a touch of magic to your singing. And now let's answer the question how to achieve it. When you play the piano, it's rather easy. So you can use your two fingers in order to achieve quite a good trill. But when we sing it, the task is not so easy for us. As I said before, a classical singing trill involves a rapid movement between two pitches. It may be a half step or a whole step apart. Of course, it is a little bit faster than I've just presented. So how to get it? How to practice this trill? You have to be relaxed. Your larynx has to be relaxed. Your throat has to be relaxed. You want your voice to be agile and move swiftly and efficiently. You have to practice a lot of arpeggios. Try to do it. Okay, and scales. Ma, me, mi, ma, ma. What is another tool to help us to practice a trill? Metronome. Okay. Oh. The next tool we can use is a metronome. Of course, we can start from the slow tempo and then we can increase the speed for example twice so let's start with for example 60 number 60 and then we will increase the speed twice uh, I know it is not perfect, of course. You know, when you try to practice it, you have to remember that it takes time, at least a few days or even a few weeks to prepare your vocal cords to this kind of ornamentation. Another secret ingredient is your breath support. Of course, we have to use our vocal cords in coordination with our breathing, with our breath support. It is very important to connect all these things together in order to receive the very, very nice sounding trill. You can control it to certain speed, but above this speed, after you reach this speed, it is a kind of uncontrolled control. So when you practice it, just try to imagine that your voice is completely free. Your larynx is completely free. You can even imagine this is the kind of sound very similar to the sound of turkeys gobbling. You can also put your hands like you would like to clap 
and shake the whole body with the sound, with the natural sound. It can help you to achieve this great trill. And now it's time to use our Vakai lesson to improve our singing skills, to improve our technique, to know how to properly sing a trill. So let's read the text of this beautiful song first. Sei povero il ruscello, mormora lento e basso, un ramo scello un sasso, quasi a restarlo fa. Se povero il ruscello, mormora lento e basso, un ramo scello un sasso, quasi, quasi a restarlo fa. Un ramo scello un sasso, quasi a restarlo fa. Let's try to translate it. If the stream is poor, he murmurs slow and low, a twig, a stone, it almost stops him. All right, and now it's time to say the text with the rhythm. I will count to four, and you will, after fourth beat, you will start to speak to say the text with the rhythm. All right, one, two, three, Four. Se povero il ruscello, mormora lento e basso, un ramo scello, un sasso, quasi a restarlo fa. Se povero il ruscello, mormora lento e basso, un ramo scello, un sasso, quasi, quasi a restarlo fa. Un ramo scello, un sasso, quasi a restarlo fa. You should sing it very lightly. At the beginning we have piano, so the piece is rather quiet. Of course, you don't have to sing it very quiet. You have to sing it uh, with the comfortable dynamic range, all right? The thing is that if you want to achieve a good trill, your larynx, your throat, your whole neck has to be relaxed, all right? And you have to work with your breath support, all right? So let's get started. Let's sing it. I will sing it for you and then you will sing it for me, all right? Se povero il ruscello Mormora lento e basso Un ramo scello, un sasso Quasi a restarlo fa Se povero il ruscello Mormora lento e basso Un ramo scello un sasso Quasi, quasi a restarlo fa all right, that was it, and now it's your turn.
Thank you so much. It was fantastic. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do it now. And if you like this video, give me the thumbs up. Check all the links below. And I encourage you to sing as often as possible. See you. Bye bye.